Hi, my name is Lindsay Warden, and I'm Holstein Association USA's Executive Director of Holstein Genetic Services. Today, I wanted to talk to you about a few facts you might not know about the Holstein breed of today. We all know that Holsteins are widely known and respected for their superior milk, fat, and protein production, but I wanted to take a couple minutes to highlight some recent information that speaks to the improvements that the Holstein breed has made in regards to health traits, particularly fertility. Since genomic testing has become commercially available for the dairy industry, we have seen the genetic progress for most traits increase at an increasing rate. We're seeing this as a real benefit for the Holstein breed as it allows us to make genetic progress in economically important traits faster than ever before. Did you know that Holstein heifers are actually the most fertile of all the dairy breeds? USDA and the Council on Dairy Cattle Breeding published statistics comparing the PTAs of all the major dairy breeds compared on a scale to Holstein's. Heifer conception rate is a new trait that was first published in December 2014, and it predicts a maiden heifer's ability to conceive, defined as a percentage of inseminated heifers that become pregnant at each service. An HCR value of 1 implies that a daughters of a certain bull are 1% more likely to become pregnant as a heifer than a bull's weaning evaluation of 0. The next closest breed to Holstein's for HCR comes in with a value at minus 0.6 for their HCR PTAs, and all the other ma major dairy breeds are over 3% less than Holstein's. Every five years, USDA and the Council on Dairy Cattle Breeding update the genetic base by which all dairy breed evaluations are based upon. Base changes are always an exciting time for a breed association because it gives us kind of a report card to measure our breed's genetic progress. Holstein's made the most genetic progress in many core traits, such as pounds of milk and pounds of protein, but the most exciting part was the high marks that Holstein cattle scored for fertility and health traits. Holstein's made the most genetic progress in productive life, making an improvement of one, which equates to about two additional months in the herd. Holstein's were the only breed to make positive genetic progress for daughter pregnancy rate, which measures the likelihood of a cow to conceive during a given 21-day period. This is a trait which many breeds have seen a downward trend in over the past several years, so we are very happy to see the Holstein breed make a positive upturn. Holstein's also the way in genetic progress for somatic cell score, heifer conception rate, and cow conception rate. With the availability of new traits like heifer and cow conception rate, Holstein Association USA created the Fertility Index and released it last December. You can find the Fertility Index values on most of our lists, and the index combines daughter pregnancy rate, heifer, heifer conception rate, and cow conception rate into one value that predicts a cow's fertility throughout her entire life. Traits such as productive life and daughter pregnancy rate, along with the new traits of heifer and cow conception rate, give breeders more information than ever before to breed exactly the kind of cow that they feel will be most profitable on their individual operations. These genetic trends that we're observing show that if breeders have access to information, they'll use it to breed healthier, more productive, and fertile cattle. We are very excited to see this progress continue to accelerate and reinforce Holstein's place as the breed of choice for U.S. dairy producers. Thank you.